hey my loves you welcome back to my channel hope you all are doing great i welcome you from wherever you are watching from it's another beautiful cold and rainy morning in benin city nigeria and i'm opening this vlog by i want to start uh, by arranging these things they've been lying here for a couple of days now i'm so ashamed of myself but guys i've been so occupied these uh, past few days i had a lot of orders to deal with and you know i come back tired i have to also prepare for the next day and all of that so as you can see we've started eating from the stuffs already like i said they've been lying here for a couple of days about three days now the sausage roll is open the water i've opened one of the milk you know it's refilled i've already poured it in a plastic container and yeah i i couldn't go shopping myself so my husband helped out though he couldn't get everything on the list but once he drives into a supermarket anything he didn't get forget it the only exciting thing about the shopping is these cookies you're looking at these are favorite cookies at home and he saw the one the root finger so instead of getting two of the usual ones he got one of this one and one of the regular ones so we've opened it as you can see we are already eating from it this cookie is, is actually very nice if you, it's good for tea if you like taking soap gary with cookies too you will also love this i use it for tea and all of that so here are the few things we got we couldn't get everything and guys trust me things are so expensive these days like when i mean expensive i don't even want to mention the amount we spent on on this little on these very few things yeah and how you know whenever my husband goes shopping himself he will not miss getting gum i love mentors gum i love zilliton but i don't like buying them because of the price <laughs> and all of this you're looking at is worth 37 okay 35 140 that's minus the noodles the noodles was bought in a from a different store and guys can you imagine like just these few things minus the noodles minus the noodles god i don't know where we are headed that's by the way so after arranging the stuffs i thought of making jollof rice because of the this thing that they've been talking about gino party jollof the hype was too much so i decided to make jollof rice with it this morning like i said my husband went shopping for me so what i wrote for him on the list was Juno party jollof because he didn't see it he just bought the regular one he didn't know the reason why i needed it so i stepped out to buy i bought these two on the street they call it party jollof tomato seasoning mix the hype was too much ignore the plenty crayfish i eat a lot of crayfish because i always add little or no seasoning to my food like it's always two cubes one cube but i'm, I'm not this maggy type so I eat a lot of crayfish. So. so I decided to give it a try. Guys, I think this is overrated. After cooking it anyway, I will allow you to be the judge. But for me, if you ask me, it just gave me the regular color that a tomato paste will give me. But the way they were hyping it, probably because they seasoned it. And I don't even like seasoned tomato paste. I will let me season it myself. Let me add the ones I want and the ones I do not want. Guys, this is early morning shower. Everywhere is dark because it's remaining cat and dog. I didn't want to do a voiceover before, but because of the noise coming from outside, the rain, the thundering, the lightning, so I just like, let me shall do this thing voiceover because the noise was too much. The background noise was too much. And here I am preparing the plantain. Yeah, you know, jello fries goes better with uh, fried plantain. Mm -hmm. and what is fried plantain without adding onions to your um hot oil it will just allow the flavor to infuse into the oil fry your plantain it takes the flavor to the next level ah and this is the result of the jollof fries i think they are overhyping this tomato sorry to say like just be the judge this is the regular color any tomato paste will give you it's overrated come on the, the way they were hyping it Imagine after buying how many rows of tomato paste, sachet tomato paste, I had to go and buy this one because I usually use sachet ones for my jollof rice. Because most times I use just two or three, but for my stew, I buy thin ones. So I don't see anything. There's not a big, there's not even popping red like they were shouting, shouting, shouting. So I'm serving my toddler here. She doesn't eat meat. This girl, you have to force her to eat meat. So her egg is not ready. So I'm serving her like that and. 
this is me taking my own food <laughs> what a boring vlog and guys mind you i eat just one meat most times you are seeing too because the other one is pomo she they say pomo is kanda is leather sorry so that's why i'm eating leather that one i don't count it as meat and this is around almost 11 past 11 pm someone asked me to help them make um a costume a mermaid costume so i was the one that sourced the fabric and i can already imagine what it will look like because hmm, i think i made the right choice yeah so i was supposed to buy a yard and a half of this fabric but because of the price it's i think i bought it for one five for a yard for with begging no so i had to buy only one yard and i had to find a way to join it to make it longer and all of that and here i am cutting this um i've forgotten what this is called it's called color stay just to make the tail of the fish don't worry you're going to see the end result and this place is on fast forward because this is not a sewing tutorial class so what's the need of making it slow so as you can see i've i'm done cutting it and the next day here we are hi guys so i'm done with the costume and this is what it looks like i want to go ahead and try it on this material i chose i think this is just perfect because it looks it has this snaky or fishy kind of look so i'm going to go ahead and try it this is my first time making a mermaid um costume and i'm going to call my husband to come and see it too because he has just seen, he has seen it like this and he was like, oh, I'm like are you serious? So I'm going to try it on my body and call him to come and see it. So I'm trying to set the camera here. So I want to lie down here. From here to here. Will you continue? Okay. Let's try. Don't worry, it's just a uh, detail. It's supposed to wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle it. Hey! No, even if I wiggle, uh, you get. Uh, you see strong, small. 